All the movements of an aircraft while in flight are controlled by three primary movements. First movement is pitch, second movement is called roll, and the last one is yaw. Let's learn about each of these movements and the control surfaces that control these movements one by one. Pitch is the movement of the aircraft about the axis of its width that is shown with the blue line in the image. This movement helps the aircraft in lifting and lowering of its nose. As a result, the aircraft will be able to climb or descend. Pitch movement of the aircraft is managed by the control surface called elevator that is situated on the horizontal tail of the aircraft which is called horizontal stabilizer. Next time when you see an aircraft be sure to observe the elevators at the tail end of the aircraft. Roll is the movement of the aircraft about the axis of its length that is shown with the blue line in the image. This movement helps the aircraft in banking movement that is needed while making the turns. Roll movement of the aircraft is managed by the control surface called aileron that is situated on its wings. To achieve bank the ailerons work in opposition. When the left aileron goes up the right aileron goes down and vice versa. When you encounter an aircraft next time make sure that you look for ailerons on the wings of the aircraft. Yaw is the movement of the aircraft about the axis of its height which is perpendicular to length and width axis of the aircraft. This axis is shown with the blue line in the image. This movement helps the aircraft to change its heading and keep its nose pointed towards the direction of travel. Yaw movement of the aircraft is managed by the control surface called rudder that is situated on its vertical tail which is known as vertical stabilizer. Do remember to look for rudder on the vertical tail of the aircraft when you see the aircraft next time.